To me, bigger surf always felt natural. I don't have to think about what I'm doing when I'm surfing. It just flows in big waves. I'm comfortable in angry seas and with big animals in the ocean. And uh, I made a living off of doing things that people are either incapable or unwilling to do in the ocean. Mark Healy is known as one of the top big wave surfers in the world. But he's also known for pushing the limits underwater as well. Girl, I'm gonna jump off. I can't really remember my first experience with the ocean. It was at such a young age. It was just always something that was part of life. I don't know, it just feels comfortable. It feels right for me to be in the ocean. I have a super busy mind. My mind is always racing. And the only way for me to kind of really have a moment where I'm just being, I'm not thinking, I'm not turning my wheels, is holding my breath surrounded by water. It's a lot of uncomfortable and soothing things mixing together and it's a kind of calm euphoria. My life definitely revolves around the ocean and what it's doing. It's just this constant state of unpredictability. It's good, it's a, it's a lively sea. Two days ago, I would have said bull sharks would be the last on my list of sharks I'd want to be around when there's a lot of them and there's big individuals and they're being fed. What I learned from sharks is don't judge a book by its cover. Sharks can't change their facial expression. You don't know how they're reacting towards you aside from body language. And they tell you the things that they want you to know with their body. They always look mean to most people. So I've learned to take any kind of stereotypes about sharks that I've heard and put them aside. So the big thing of this project is to change people's perceptions towards sharks. So that people get down there, get to swim around in amongst all these big animals, and then come away with a changed view to the importance of the shark in the ocean, and also the fact that it's very little threat to them as a diver. Sharks are honest. You get to judge sharks solely on their actions. People have ulterior motives. I think people are way more dangerous than sharks. Humans are a part of the ocean. This is some of the most condensed forms of energy that our planet can produce. And you're being a part of that in a natural way. I love the beauty of the ocean that it brings out what people really have. Can't lie to it, can't bluff it, can't bribe it, can't talk it out of anything. It is the equalizer. I definitely see myself as being part of the ocean as opposed to being a visitor. When I hit the water, I feel like I'm home. Everything else is, uh, I don't know, it's not as simple.